Welcome to our contractor and vista induction for this site. Every single employee we have is so important to us and therefore we adopt a policy of zero harm. We are legally and morally responsible for the safety of all people on this site. To this end it is a requirement that you must comply to any direction by any of our staff members at any time. While you are on this site, the following key personnel are available to assist you at any time with any questions you may have on your safety. This is also a sensitive site. The taking of photos is not permitted without the authority of the facilities officer. Any tool bags, ordinary bags and vehicles may be required to be presented for inspection at any time. If you observe any suspicious activity or persons, please notify one of our supervisors or one of our staff members immediately. All movement on this site is strictly controlled. You must obey all signage, traffic arrows and as a pedestrian, keep to the marked walkways. Mobile phones are permitted, but you must not be moving while talking. You must ensure you are in a safe place, stop any movement, have your conversation and on completion you can continue with your activity. The use of ear pieces attached to devices like iPods and MP3 players are not permitted. These may be a distraction to your work and may prevent you from hearing other activities when it is important to do so. This site supports a smoke free environment. Smoking is only permitted where designated. Seek guidance from our supervisors or our staff as to the location where you can smoke if you need to do so. Alcohol and non-prescription drugs are not permitted at any time. If you are currently taking prescription drugs, you must inform the safety advisor for guidance on the effect of the task you are here for. Some locations on this site have additional safety obligations that require you to sign in and sign out of a visitor's register. Upon entry to any control building, visitors and contractors must ensure they locate and notify the team leader for that location of their intent and reason for visit. A local specific safety induction may be delivered. All contractors should provide their work method statement and this must be agreed by our staff before any work is commenced. In many cases you'll be asked to read and acknowledge our own safe work instructions that are specific to some high risk activities. Non-compliance to the guidance in these instructions may result in a stop work order being given. If this occurs no further work can be undertaken until approval has been given by this site. While on this site you will encounter various types of mechanical handling equipment MHE. All personnel must respect the MHE operator has the right of way and be conscious of its operations. No person is allowed within three meters of any operating MHE. MHE is restricted to five kilometers an hour and must sound its horn when entering or leaving any facilities. You are required to wear the proper serviceable personal protective equipment for the task you are performing. Some locations require additional personal protective equipment and this is signposted accordingly. It will also be a part of the location safety brief. You should have all your own PPE, but please ask at the end of this induction if any assistance is required. Dangerous goods may be stored on this site. If you require access to these areas, a separate induction will be supplied at that location. Asbestos may be in a number of the facilities on this site. Labels are present where asbestos is known to exist. If any work is to be conducted that will bring you into contact with asbestos, specific rules must be adhered to. Please speak to one of our staff members prior to commencing work. This video demonstrates a simple but effective way to deliver your site safety inductions. If you want more information on how this was constructed and a full video demonstration, go to our website or email me at markpearson at onestopsolutions.com.au or phone me on my mobile 0434 602 372.